Good morning, everyone. I have a special friend to join us because we're finishing Toy Story today. Oh, okay. So, yeah, you know, I can't remember. Um, well, I can't. I forget everything, don't I? Oh, it's so hard not having you guys around to remind me of all the stuff I need to do. Well, I'm having a hard time remembering what we read about yesterday. So I thought, oh gosh, I'm just going to read it before I read it to you guys. And I thought, no, I'm going to do that thing. Do you remember what I love to do with books? I love to read the books. But what's the other thing I love to do with books? Oh, I heard you. I love to picture walk. So I'm going to retell the first part of the story by looking at the pictures. And I'm hoping you can help me. All right. I, I remember. Who's that? Yes, Andy. Andy loved his toys. He loved playing with his toys. And he loved all his toys, but he had two favorites. Do you remember who they are? Oh, yes, I heard Woody and Buzz. Those were his two favorite toys. Yeah. Andy kind of took them everywhere, didn't he? Mm. Oh, but then, boom, 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 something terrible happened. Who was, who was toy napped? And what does toy napped mean? Oh, oh, it means someone took the toy. Which toy did they take? Yes, he took Woody. Oh, oh, that's right. Because Woody wasn't just a toy. He was a famous toy. And who did that, that guy already have? He already had Prospector Pete. Oh, what's her name? What's that girl's name? Ah, yeah, Jessie. And, oh, oh. What's, what's the horse's name? Jesse's horse. Bullseye. Got it. So he had all them. And where did he want to send all those toys? To a museum in Japan. And remember yesterday we talked about how far away Japan is. Oh, but did Woody want to go? No, at first he didn't. He wanted to go back to Andy. But then remember, Jessie talked to him and she told him about how she had a little girl and her little girl loved her and played with her. But then what happened? Mm -hmm. The little girl grew up and she forgot about Jessie. Wow, that would make me feel so bad if someone forgot about me. Mm. So that made Woody start to think. Huh. Hmm. But back at home, what were the other toys doing? Yes, they were planning a rescue mission. Oh, yeah. Toys to the rescue. Oh, yeah. Here they go. And they're off. And remember how they had to cross that busy road? But they did it by going under traffic cones. Yes. And then remember how Buzz saw all the other Buzzes in the toy store? And he got very confused. And they met the... Evil Zerg. Oh, ready? Oh, 
Okay, I, the ball is supposed to shoot out. Ready? Well, that was kind of a dud. Ha! Ah, but he's an evil person! Ugh. Oh my goodness, I gotta turn. But nothing would stop Buzz and his friends from finding Woody. Ah, and who did they find? They found Al in the office. But there was a problem. The toys weren't at the store. Where were they? Yeah, they were at Al's apartment. So they followed him to his apartment. But then there was another problem. You're right. Woody had decided to go to the museum with the other Roundup toys. He didn't want to end up forgotten and in storage. Oh, so then we weren't sure would Woody go back home to Andy or would he go to Japan to the museum? Let's see. Buzz tried to convince Woody to go home to Andy, but the cowboy had made up his mind. So Buzz and the others left without Woody. I don't think I can go on. Andy's going to be so sad if Woody's not there. Oh, this is a bad plot twist. Oh, let's, we've got to go on. I need to know what happens. It didn't take Woody long to realize that he had made a mistake. His true place was with Andy and not in the museum. Oh, but the prospector had a different plan. He was going to the museum and no cowboy would stand in his way. He trapped Woody, Jesse, and Bullseye in the apartment. Then Al took them away. Woody's friends had to rescue him, but first they had to defeat. Bum, 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 the evil Zerg. Now they had to hurry. Al was on his way to the airport. Next stop, Japan. Ugh, hurry, guys, hurry. Oh my goodness, they've got to get Woody. Buzz Lightyear to the rescue. Buzz, Mr. Potato Head, Ham, Rex, and Slinky borrowed a car. Should you borrow a car? No, no, we should not borrow cars. And they raced to the airport. Oh, they rescued Woody and Bullseye and sent the prospector packing. Unfortunately, oh, they, they rescued Woody, Bullseye, and they sent the prospector packing. Who is missing? Jesse. Unfortunately, poor Jesse got stuck on the plane. Get her. They've got to get her. She can't go by herself. That would be so scary. Would Woody and Buzz be able to save her? Of course they would. Yeah. Whoa. Look. Go. Yay. <laughs> They're doing it. They did it. Oh, wow. What good friends. Soon, Woody, Buzz, Rex, Ham, Mr. Potato Head, and Slinky were back in Andy's room, along with their new friends, Jesse and Bullseye. All the toys knew they couldn't stop Andy from growing up, but they wouldn't miss it for the world. That's such a good ending. Friends are so important to have. I'm going to cry a little bit. You know I cry when I read a happy book. They're not sad tears, are they? They're, are they? They're happy tears, huh? Yes. Friends are so important to have. Even when you can't see them. Like, we are all such good friends in our classroom. 
But even when we can't see each other, that's we're still friends, right? Yes, I think about you guys every single day. And I think about fun stuff to do with you guys. I have a really fun thing that I'm going to do for you. All right, hold on. Okay, I have a really fun game to play with you guys. All right, so I have some cups. <clears throat> These are just regular old, they're like party cups, but you can use any kind of cups. Like I have some, um, they're those little cups that I use when I'm brushing my teeth. I put some water in. You could use those. You could you could even really use a regular cup if you wanted to. But you have to do one thing to these cups. You have to Oh. You have to put a sight word on the bottom. I just put my sight words on sticky notes and I stuck them I stuck a sight word on the bottom of each note. I mean, on each cup. So there's one on every cup. Sight words, sight words, gotta get them right words. Okay, so let's see here. How many cups do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I have twelve cups. You don't have to use 12. You can use as many as you want. But each cup has a sight word on the bottom. Now, this is where I need I need someone to hide something under a cup for me. But since there is no one else here with me but Lucy, and you know Lucy can't do that, I'm going to do it myself. I'm just going to close my eyes and I'm going to grab a cup. And I'm going to put something under it. And then I'm mixing them all up. Because I don't want to know what, what it's under. Okay. So now I have to try to find the hidden object. You could put anything under the cups. Okay. If I was eating sugar, I would use Hershey Kisses. Because, you know, I love Hershey Hershey's chocolate, but since you know I don't eat sugar anymore, uh, I have a fun toy under here. So let me see here. I'm going to pick a cup and I have to read the word. What word is that? W A S. Was. Okay, so I got it right. So I get to keep the cup turned up. Mm, let me find another one. Oh, this one. Oh, guess what? I found the toy. <laughs> I found Woody. Uh huh. Can you believe that? On oh, my second, I can't keep him until I read the word. Help me! Help me read it. C A N. What is it? Say it loud. <gasps> Can. Thank you. Awesome. Awesome. So now if I had a Hershey Kiss under there or a Skittle, I could eat it. Okay, so I'm going to get another toy. And I'm going to hide it under one of these. Now remember, you know, you could get your mom or your dad or your brother or your sister or your grandma or grandpa to do this with you. And they could hide it because it'd be a lot more fun. <gasps> you guys could like take turns. That would be even more fun. I wish Lucy could play with me. All right, I'm gonna to try to find it. Mm, I'm going for one back here. Oh, it's not there, but I need to read the word. H-A-V-E. What is it? What? Oh, have, 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 have. Okay, I'm gonna try another one. Oh. You guys, I'm the luckiest person in the world. Look at the word, L-O-O-K, look, and look what was under it, ha, ah, Forky. Okay, so now I have Woody and Forky. Mm -hmm. Let me get another one. Oh yeah, I got one, okay. All right, not gonna look. Did you see what I put under there? 
I hope not. It's a secret. Okay, ready? I'm going with this one. Oh, not in there. Help me, help me. S A I D. Sid. Sid. Who can use said in a sentence? <laughs> I, I heard someone say, my mom said no. <laughs> that was a funny sentence. Very good job. Okay. All right, I'm going to try another one. Oh, there's nothing there. Okay, spell it with me. L-I-K-E. What is it? Like. All right, who wants to use like in a sentence? Okay, everybody use like in a sentence. Oh my goodness, I heard someone say, I like Lucy. I like Lucy too, that was good. Okay, I'm gonna pick another. Okay. Oh, oh. oh there's nothing there. What is it? Y O U. You. you. Guess what? I like you. All right, we're getting low. Oh, 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 I got it, I got it, but I have to read the word first. Uh-oh, it's falling off. A-N-D, and. Okay, are you ready to see what I got? Bo Peep. Mm -hmm. Let's see, I got Bo Peep. I have Forky. I have Woody. Hmm, I'm gonna get somebody else. Let me see here. Oh, I seem to be missing somebody. Huh, let's see here, I got one. Oh, I only have four cups left. Okay, all right, okay. You guys, this is hard. T H E Y. It's not the. <gasps> Thank you, they. Everybody spell they. T H E Y. Read it. They. Good job, good job. Good job, good job. All right. Oh, not the. <laughs> o A R E. It's a pirate's favorite word. What is it? R. Very good. <laughs> Very good. Okay, should I do this one or this one? I don't know. Okay, I'm going to. Oh, it's not under there. Help me, help me. Let's spell it. T H E. Read it. The, the, the. Good job. Okay, here's the last one. And I know my thing is under there, but I don't want you to see it yet. Oh, you guys, let's spell it. D-O-E-S. Oh my goodness, I heard you does. Ready, let's spell it again. D-O-E-S, read it. Does, does, does. Who does Miss Burgess have? Are you ready? <gasps> it's Jessie. It's Jessie. So let's see here. I have Jessie. I have Bo Peep. I have Forky. I have Woody. I could, um, I could, I could retell some of the book we just read. I could make a new story with my friends. Oh, that was fun. That was a fun time. So you could do this at home, couldn't you? You don't have to put your words on sticky notes. You could even, if you have paper cups, you could just write the word on there. This is a great fun way to practice reading your sight words. Because remember, sight words, sight words, gotta get them right words. Okay, you guys keep reading. And I will see you.
tomorrow with a new book. I can't wait to see you again. I love you. Bye. Oh.